Good morning. Sunday morning. Happy Sunday and Merry Christmas. It is Christmas Eve, and I hope you all are enjoying your time with family. And if you're finding some time for his education, welcome. Thank you for being here. If you are new to this channel and new to this series, the game is simple. If you laugh, you lose. All right, and you have to do a punishment. What is today's punishment? Since it is Christmas Eve, folks, there's no punishment today. All you have to do is watch last week's Try Not To Laugh episode and all of the upcoming episodes this week. Dave is joining me on Tuesday, and we have Megan joining both Dave and I for a very, very special episode. Also, I want to address this. Uh, I, I may have gotten a few of you into some trouble here. So <laughs> check out this comment. This is gold. From Lily Lily 3 my six-year-old daughter silently watched this video with me. A few minutes after the end, she said, Mama, you did laugh. Can I have an early Christmas present? Thanks, Tyler. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's the punishment. Did you let your kids open the gifts or no? Huh? That was the punishment. And it looks like, look at this. I actually played along, let my kids open a present because I laughed at the incredibly stupid Big Pharma joke. That was a good one. It's him. It's Big Pharma. <laughs> so stupid. Now they own Minecraft. On the plus side, they reiterated that I am the best dad ever as a result. Afterwards, my oldest daughter exclaimed, I love Tyler Zed. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. If you are ready for today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you laugh, you lose, go. Coming to Netflix, Frosty the Snowman. Uh, it, it, isn't that already on Netflix, huh? <laughs> My sister really is the worst human ever. Present that has, what is this? I couldn't afford a present this year, so I got you this box. Oh, it's real nice. Real nice. You know what? I've said this many times. If you're an adult, you, don't, you shouldn't get presents for each other. Maybe that's controversial. Maybe your spouses, yes, you should maybe get a present for your spouse, but cousins, aunts, uncles, eh. Bring him a plate of cookies. Mariah Carey being summoned back to hell on December 26th. <laughs> I love how this is like, you know, an annual perennial meme at this point. Not, I only heard the song a few times this year and I, I've listened to the Christmas stations. I have more than I have in a long time. Ozzy Osbourne showing exactly how much sugar to put in his Christmas cookie recipe, circa 1984. You're a little light on the sugar there, Ozzy. I think cookies have a lot more, but um, yeah, grow up. All right, through the snow. Mm. Mm. Dashing through the snow. Get it? You get it? Dashing through the snow. <laughs> Stupid. Peppermint pickle and hot dog holiday pie. If Monday was pie. You know what? That ain't tomorrow's pie. Tomorrow's pie is looking delish. That's Tuesday's pie. That's disgusting, by the way. Dave might actually eat that. My boss and I had an ugly sweater competition. I love that. I, I absolutely love that. Um... <laughs> Get it? Cause you're making you make it ugly. <laughs> Your reflection makes it ugly. <laughs> You've heard of Elf on a Shelf. Now get ready for Chewy on a Buoy. Oh, that's dumb. We have a oh, we're barely even into the video so far. Oh, oh, that's bad. Your home, as seen by you, buyers, appraiser, tax assessor. Yeah, it's kind of scary what they can do with taxes. They can just raise your property taxes, you know? And that's how they do it, too. Oh, yeah, well, it's worth actually more. So you gotta pay more. When Christmas magic hits differently as an adult. <laughs> you know, uh, Christmas magic, again, this is what happens, kids. Don't become one of these people. Live within your means, and a lot of that stress goes away. You're not going to be punching the, the blow-up thing out in the, in the yard. <laughs> You've heard of Elf on the Shelf. Now get ready for Shaggy in a Baggy. Hmm. 
Mm, shaggy on a bag. Whatever. I'm over these shelf, elf on a shelf ones. Dumb. You don't have to get me anything for Christmas. It's a trap. <laughs> don't fall for it. You still have some time. I think it's if it's Sunday morning right now, I, something might be open for until like noon, maybe. Hopefully it's not open. If she said don't get her anything, don't fall for it, man. Don't do it. It's a trap. <laughs> Family starts opening Christmas presents. Dad's collecting the wrapping paper in the bag now. Yes, that that is me. I think this is one of the things that like the switch turns on when you become a dad. I, I'm not even kidding you. Like I go to other kids' birthday parties, and I'm doing this. I don't even know it. Like it's just part of you at that at this point. When you become a dad, this is what happens. It's like part of your DNA. Warning: If you get a link called Justin Bieber sings Christmas carols, don't open it. It's Justin Bieber singing Christmas carols. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it. All right, for being honest, like, he's not a bad singer. All right, so let's leave the jokes to Taylor Swift, Mariah Carey. They're just slightly worse, so. Arizona snowman. Yeah. I was in a few winters without snow when I lived in Texas and Japan, and it's weird, man. Christmas without snow, is it's just weird. For lease Navidad. I think that other meme, the the least Navi dot. Can we can we replay that one, Megan? If you remember what I'm talking about. What's the Christmas song that be like the least Navi dot? It's Spanish. Are you serious? <laughs> the least Navi dot. Do 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 do. The least Navi dot. <laughs> that one broke me. That was funny. And now this should be funny, but that one was funnier. So yeah, I just, I can't laugh at it. I don't know. That's what happens. Grandma, what you want for Christmas, my dear? Me. Nice rims for my car. Grandma, say no more. <laughs> and you know what? You damn right you're putting them on. If grandma made it for you, you're you're using it. You're wearing it on your, on your person. If she made you a sweater, you're wearing it. Made you a hat, you're wearing it. She made you some rims. You're damn well putting them on. You be good to your grandma. Meanwhile, in Boston, no Christmas party? Christmas party. <laughs> you know, it's kind of funny, but it's not because that really happened. We covered it in last Tuesday's video. The Boston mayor like had a segregated Christmas party. Like, how is it? You guys, what are we doing? <laughs> Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Yuletide gay. I don't like them putting chemicals in the eggnog that turns the frickin' Yuletides gay. <laughs> Shout out to AJ there. Yeah, that's, I love that. That's a great meme. <laughs> Merry, uh, uh, happy, uh, you know, the thing. Mm. I hope that's not on your tree right now. Happy Easter, everybody. Only Tyler can make Phil Collins sound like Nickelback. Did I, it sounded like Nickelback. Uh, can we get another replay, Megan? I feel like that's, isn't that kind of a mandatory thing when you listen to that song? I can feel it coming in here tonight. Do, 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 I can't help it. Nickelback is in my blood. All right, Nickelback. You know, that's how I sing. I can't help it. It's just, Tyler, nobody likes a snitch. Proceeds to rat Deve out like 360,421 times in one video. And clearly didn't get the joke from the Elf movie. What joke? The, the one where the, the, the 26-year-old mailman, right? Tyler's Christmas list. One, buy me groceries. Two, watch my kid. <laughs> that's, it's like a, that's an invaluable service, you know? Parents need a break. Named my Christmas tree Amy Winehouse because it's just going to die and leave needles all over the place. Come on. Come on. No. No. Don't laugh at that. Uh, I hope it's a PS5. <laughs> I, you know, I don't know what it is. You might have got a PS5. Maybe not. Maybe. I don't know. Open it up. See. I noticed you said Merry Christmas instead of Happy Holidays. I also like to live dangerously. <laughs> Now, you always always say Merry Christmas. 
Always. It's Christmas. Someone doesn't like it, then get they can get over it. It's their problem. My uncle walked into Christmas, filled a plate, ate in a separate room, and left. He was here four minutes. I think we had someone like this. Maybe this might have been the same meme on, on Thanksgiving. I love this. Sometimes you got to do what you got to do. You got to show up. You got to fulfill your commitment as an uncle. And then that's it. You, you showed face. You checked the box. All right. Maybe your family doesn't like you. Maybe they don't like you for the things you, you believe in, right? It is what it is. You made it. You showed up. Self-employed Christmas party. You, know, you got a, you're solo, huh? No employees. This is uh, kind of the Zed media party. Got four employees. Um, Megan's over in Sweden. Well, she's back now, but she'll be gone. So we're having a party, folks. We're having a party. When I wrap a presents, how many, look under your tree right now. How many presents look like that? Whoever wrapped that present is smart. <laughs> I, I'll say it right now. I appreciate someone who takes the time, makes it look real nice, puts bows on it, maybe some ribbons, right? I love those people. That being said, like, it's just going to get ripped up anyways. The whole point is to hide it, right? Controversial Christmas take? I don't know. This is okay. You can do this. Couldn't choose between a star or an angel, so I went with both. R.I.P. Dale. And actually, I mean that. I'm not making a joke right now. That's, yeah. Yeah. Uh, where were you? I actually remember where I was. That was my cousin's birthday party when it happened. Ah, uh, R.I.P. When you lean a little too far back on the ladder while hanging the Christmas lights. <laughs> See you bye. See you bye. Yeah, hopefully there's some snow on the ground where you're at and you land and don't break your back. Me, December 1st. Me, December 31st. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, I think I do like the holidays. December is a freaking crazy month this this month, this in 2023. But, um, yeah, it's worth it, man. It's worth it. You don't realize how old you are until you sit on the floor to wrap Christmas gifts and then try to get up. <laughs> Any of you have this problem this year, huh? Hey, beautiful sights. We're happy tonight. Walking under women's underwear. Where the hell is this? What is this? That's what you're you're decorating. You're decorating your streets with women's underwear. Four stages of a man's life. One, you believe in Santa. Two, you don't believe in Santa. Three, you are Santa. Four, you look like Santa. <laughs> you can pretend to be Santa, but you'll never be the real Santa. All right? And you, you don't believe... Really? You're too old for that, huh? No. He's real. Trust me. Me. Call your mother and tell her we aren't going to be there for Christmas. Husband. Yeah, yeah. I just, I'll just do it. No big deal. I'll just dive into it and just start singing. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. My heart is beating so fast <laughs> right now. <laughs> How many of you were in that situation? Did, uh, did you, you couldn't make it home for one reason or another. You had to go do something else. And then, uh, yeah, you got reamed out. I'm going to tell my kids this is Santa Claus on a sled. Well, it's, it's not Santa Claus. It's easy to mistake. That's his cousin. Um, John Claus Daly. Changed his name to Daly because, yeah, he, didn't, he, he likes being a Claus, but, you know, it just causes a rift here and there. When all your presents are pre-wrapped. Hey, look at that. How many of you have presents that look like that? All right, I have to say, I think that's, that is not okay. Okay, you got to do something. The halls, boughs of holly. Deck the boughs of holly. Ha la 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 la. Dumb. Chad Kroger from Nickelback loves appearing in Nativity Plays. He's been a shepherd, an innkeeper. He's even played the back end of the donkey. But he's never made it as a wise man. Mm. Never made it as a wise man. I couldn't cut it as a poor man stealing. I bet you know the next words of that song, don't you? Wayne County Life, shout out. Point of view. You're giving your coworker their Christmas gift. <laughs> you must hate your coworkers. 
um, giving them the the five finger, the five knuckle sandwich there for Christmas. That's that's tough. Shout out to the mom and dad in a Christmas story just chugging wine for breakfast. <laughs> you know, I uh, I never noticed that. Huh. God, why are men so hard to get gifts for? WTF do you people want? Is that a joke? I Dude, I feel like at least myself and all of my friends would be the easiest people ever to buy for. We all have a million hobbies. Golf, fishing, cars, you know? I mean, like, we don't buy clothes for ourselves. So, like, you could get, it's an infinite amount of, like, every holiday, you know, birthday, Christmas, a sweatshirt. Like, it's so easy. Ladies, is it, do you have this problem? Oh, <laughs> dude, look at this. <laughs> Who the hell? That is the worst Santa I've ever seen. Kid, if kids out there, if Santa looks like that, uh, Santa hired a temp, man. It's a busy time of year. Mistletoe is an evergreen plant which produces oval leaves, white berries, and sexual harassment lawsuits. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, don't uh, make sure it's mutual, right? I'd sing you a Christmas song, but I hate carols. <laughs> I haven't seen a Tiger King meme for a while. Never let this die. If Santa isn't real, then who just got into my apartment without a key? Checkmate, non-believers. Help, I think I'm being robbed. <laughs> Taking family Christmas pictures after the pictures have been taken. Is this your family? Did you guys already take Christmas pictures? Did the fight already happen? Did, you, did the fight happen before Christmas pictures? F your Zodiac, which one is the GOAT? Ooh, that's tough, man. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna exclude a Christmas story because I've seen it a thousand times and it's on repeat for like a week every every year. Elf is good. Christmas vacation, decent. I gotta go home alone. I gotta go home alone. When you're wrapping Christmas presents and the scissors start to glide. Ooh, yeah! That's a good feeling. That's a good that's a good sound effect right there. They can put that on on a freaking movie. Great feeling. The Santa PetSmart advertise versus Oh my god, okay. This is what I wanted, okay? This is the pastels. And this is what I got. The Santa they had. Okay. All right. You know. Santa, sometimes he has to have his elves go and do that. And, you know, sometimes all the elves, they're not necessarily in the same shape. It just is what it is, you know? A Binomics Christmas. Yeah. <clears throat> they try to tell you it, things are good, but you guys know. You guys bought presents. You're buying groceries. Yes. Next, we've been over this. A perfect Midwest Christmas gift doesn't exist. Hell yeah. Cole's cash. Kirko. Kirko Chains, we miss you, buddy. We need you, man. Oh, your back man get, get better get better knock knock knocking on kevin's door a knock knock knocking on kevin's door free for uh for booking in january die hard isn't a christmas movie because it occurs on christmas it's a christmas movie because it's about a social obligation with a family member that you didn't want to participate in but spirals more and more into an unending nightmare <laughs> That's funny. It was the week before Christmas when all through the house, the AC was running because we live in the South. <laughs> Stupid. You guys got the AC on right now? Or our heat's blaring, it's cold. Kids today are so coddled. Elf on the Shelf, Toy Story. In my day, if dolls magically came to life, they murdered you and everyone you loved. Ooh, look at that. I, ooh, next. I'm, I'm scared right now. I hate that movie. Santa's workshop, but different. All right, next one on the list is Billy. He really wants a hamster. Um, Is he on the naughty or on the nice list? Naughty. Okay. You know what? Let's get him the hamster. What, really? Yeah. But make it old so that it dies a week later. Jeez. Um, where are the presents? They need to be done soon. But we're working as hard as we can. I told you, I don't need efficiency. I need effectiveness. I'm tired of this, Santa. That's too damn bad. Santa, you're being kind of mean. 
and your mom's a ho ho ho. Santa, Mindy made it onto the nice list last second. Uh, what were we going to give her? You said to give her divorced parents. Yeah, we should do that. Elves, I want Rudolph to be in front this time. Because of his really shiny nose? No, that's a tumor. It's going to be his last trip. Also, which one of them ate my shoe? Um, it was Blitzen. Right, okay, we're going to make ragu out of him. What? But I like Blitzen! No, trust me, you're going to like how he tastes even more. Alright, that was dark. Uh... <laughs> wow, okay, next. Santa is out here working extra jobs to afford y'all's presence in this bad economy. <laughs> Uh, that's actually, that's really Santa. He That's a true picture right there. He was really selling frozen bananas. Hey, we paid you a million dollars to shave with our razor. Why do you still have a beard? You didn't say it had to be my face. That's disgusting. x -mas tree, y -mas tree, z -mas tree. Frickin' nerds, man. Frickin' nerd humor. That is not okay. Delete that. I do all of my Christmas shopping at the airport. <laughs> Believable. Believable, sadly. A wreath of Franklin. Oh! Oh, so bad. That is so bad. So we have so many corny jokes. Get it, Aretha Franklin, the singer. A wreath of Franklin. <laughs> Dumb. Her, why do you need another buck mount? Me, to finish the team. Alrighty then. That's honestly, that's kind of impressive. You have a lot of big mounts there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You already have nine, buddy. You know what? Whatever, man. Whatever. Point of view, your wife just cursed you out for an hour because you bought your two month old daughter a golf simulator for Christmas. I love it. Yeah, just sitting there having some Knob Creek, huh? Hey. One day she'll she'll grow to appreciate it. Make sure you teach her how to putt. Start with putting, then chipping, then get to the irons. Um, that golf simulator, it will it will help her create a life skill. When your wife asks you to not embarrass her at the family Christmas party. <laughs> Get that on video. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Lay off the hard eggnog, buddy. Someone check on him. I'm gonna hurt his elbow. Right, those, those lights just went on too. Hopefully they just got unplugged. Mm. Again, lay off the hard eggnog. Me wondering why I got coal this year, and then I remember all the Ocean Gate memes I posted. <laughs> Did you get cool? This is probably why. It's all right. You know what? I shared one too many as well. It is what it is. I got cool myself. Um, you know, hopefully Santa comes back tonight and, and exchanges that coal. But that's what happens, man. That's what happens. Never stop sharing the memes. Ever. How'd you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose. And again, you just got to go watch the best of trying not to laugh and everything that we are going to be releasing this upcoming week. So we've got a jam packed week for you of videos. Let me know how you did down in the comments while you're down there. Please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. And once again, Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas folks. I hope you have a great one with your family. I hope Santa comes tonight. It doesn't bring you coal for sharing the ocean gate memes, but accept your outcome. This is what you did throughout 2023. That is it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed, and this is Education. For the children. Idiots.